Welcome back. I'm frequently asked about Microsoft Endpoint Manager and Microsoft Intune. Does it have an enterprise application catalog that my users can browse to download apps, whether they're line of business apps created by my organization or other types of applications created by third-party developers? And the answer is yes, it absolutely does. So let me show you a little bit about that. I'm gonna open up here on my Mac. I'm gonna to go to Microsoft Endpoint Manager and we're gonna browse over to apps on the left side and go to Mac OS. Now I'll do another video where we go more in depth in apps later on, but here I've actually added some apps to the catalog. You can see I've added uh, Adobe Reader, Google Chrome, Defender ATP, the new Microsoft Edge Chromium browser for Mac, also Microsoft 365 apps like you know, Outlook, Excel, PowerPoint, Word. And I could just simply click on add and I can upload a custom line of business app if I want or shortcut web links and of course some of the Microsoft apps. I'll do another video on how to do that uh, on another video. But I've already done this. And if I come over here to apps, down at the bottom, you'll have app categories. So then I can add my own categories and kind of tell these different apps which categories to, to be a part of. When I do this, if we go back to my app and we take something like Google Chrome, once I have uploaded this app, I will have the ability to assign it. And right now I have it assigned for all available enrolled devices and for all users. So what that means is when that user opens up the Endpoint Manager Company Portal app on their Mac, and they go to the Apps tab, they will see those apps in the catalog, and then they can double click on them and actually install them. And if they wanted to, they can browse the different categories of apps if I have the categories enabled, like you saw. So it's really easy, and uh, I can have a corporate app store, if you will. So if I wanna install Google Chrome, all I have to do is just click on Install, and it will kick off the install process for that app here on my Mac. So folks, that's really it. There's not much to it other than going into Endpoint Manager and uploading the app, publishing it, adding some, uh, some variables here like a description and who the publisher is and uh, some other things. I'll do another video on all of these details, but if you make it available for enrolled devices, it will show up here. And here you can see it's downloading it. It'll take a few moments to download and then it will start to automatically install because I packaged this to be deployed to Mac OS. And I'll do another video on that. Okay, hope you found value in this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Be sure to click subscribe so you can be notified when I upload a new video. Uh, if you didn't find value, let me know. Give me some feedback. How can I improve? And if you're using this, I wanna hear about it. Put it in the comments, reach out to me on LinkedIn. I wanna know how you're using Endpoint Manager and Intune to manage your Mac devices. Okay, folks, take care. We got a lot more videos coming on Mac OS, so we'll see you in the next one.